cooking fish today. A little fishy, babe. Uh, yeah, very fishy. Can't even So we're back home from church. We had a fun time. We love our new lights in the kitchen. They're very bright. Yeah, very bright. No, but we had a good time in church. The oven's a little whiny, so hopefully he can finish lunch soon. Go down for a nap. Thorin's sleeping right now. And Chris is making tilapia and asparagus. Yummy. No, it's been a good weekend. I had to work yesterday. I'm working in today. But hey, it's good. So Chris has finally done two day, uh, one day without any help. Not the first time. But I mean, like... Since you've been home, yeah. Since I've been home. You had that one weekend when your mom left. Yeah. Which was last weekend, I guess. So, I guess it's really not that important. Ooh. See me. Stay me. What, did you finish your fruit? You didn't finish your fruit pouch. There you go. You need to finish it all up. There's a lot more in here. I'll help you out. Maybe there isn't as much as I thought. That's not something to chew on. But that is. He's so adorable. Did you like your fruit pouch? Or is this a vegetable? A fruit and vegetable. Is he getting asparagus too? I'm probably not. Oh, okay. I'm gonna say, you're getting a lot of vegetables today. Yeah. Yeah. Theo did and I just woke up from our Sunday afternoon nap. Thorin is still asleep, thank goodness. So Theo and I are getting some one-on-one -on -one craft time. He is painting. Or it's not painting. We are not doing paint today. <laughs> we are coloring. Show them what you're coloring. <coughs> See, I'm coloring dinosaurs. You can tell them you're coloring dinosaurs? <coughs> yeah. You keep pushing your crayons really far away. Here you go. Good job. He is left-handed. That is something we have been learning. Whoa, whoa, you want a new page? All right, let's find you a new page. Oh, you want a page with stickers? Daddy would not be happy if he saw that. Choose your sticker. Do you want, let's see if they have a velociraptor since that happens to be your favorite animal. Right there? <gasps> Good job, put it on. Oh, 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 there we go. You think that's funny? You lost your sticker. I got it. Oh, oh. <laughs> what? Here's your sticker back. Say mwah. Ready? Boop. <laughs> How do you have food in your hair? Uh, oh. You found your belly button! Oh. There it is! Oh my! Where's your belly button? Where, not your ears, your belly button. There's your belly button! <laughs> belly button. <laughs> You're gonna make a, make a face? Say belly button, make a face. Boop. You telling them a story? Oh, there's your belly button. Well, it doesn't get any closer than that to your face. Look, watch. Gracious. Come here. Let's play with brother. Look. Ow. You gotta be gentle, on mommy. So, we went a little crazy today. <laughs> Last night was kind of rough with me and the boys. They cried a lot, so I didn't end 
the last vlog. That's that's why. But anyway, John told me this morning to do something for myself. So I did something. A little bigger than what he was expecting. I bought fish. So he's setting up our 10 gallon fish tank. Because I bought fishies. You're supposed to set up the tank about a day before you actually do this, but I I don't have a day. I work last minute. Ah! <laughs> Last one is the way to go. <laughs> Do you want a small small bed or a thick bed? That's plenty right there. Well, I'm just asking because you can do a thick bed. No, let's just rock that. Up to here. What do you think is better? It's up to you. It's how you want to look. You can have a thick bed. And if we get fish later that can burrow, we can have burrow okay. fish. Okay, that's fine. You can do that. So I did buy enough rocks. Look at this kid. He's smiling like crazy. Oh, but he's about to get mad. I was out for a little bit longer than he likes, I think. He's probably really hungry. <laughs> oh. One important aspect of fi fish keeping is acclimation. So what you need to do, it's important to have the fish tank, the fish get used to the temperature of the water. So you actually put the fish in the water so they get temperature acclimated. Otherwise, they can go into shock and potentially die. So that's no bueno. So they're acclimating now. And Theo didn't close the door on us. Thank you for using the water jug. Yeah, so she got four zebra danios, and apparently they accidentally gave her a uh, snail, which snails are awesome. I love snails. We finally got the laugh on camera. <laughs> well, we got the clap. <laughs> We are out on a nature walk, hike, thing, early this morning. It's very bumpy. <laughs> it is. But it's very worth it. Oh yeah. That was really nice though, that's for sure. Ooh, there's bird feeders. Oh. In the distance. That's where you can't walk. Thank you.